A hero is somebody who voluntarily walks into the unknown. I want to have a good time myself. I don't want to dread going to work no matter what the gig is. I think, selfishly, I will make sure that I have a good time. How about that? Some people are cowards. I think by and large a third of people are villains, a third are cowards, and a third are heroes. Now, a villain and a coward can choose to be a hero, but they've got to make that choice. If you have to have a job in this world, a high-priced movie star is a pretty good gig. There isn't any great mystery about me. What I do is glamorous and has an awful lot of white-hot attention placed on it. But the actual work requires the same discipline and passion as any job you love doing, be it as a very good pipe fitter or a highly creative artist. I think it's better to feel good than to look good. I love what I do for a living. It's the greatest job in the world, but you have to survive an awful lot of attention that you don't truly deserve and you have to live up to your professional responsibilities, and I'm always trying to balance that with what is really important. My job has always been to hold a mirror up to nature. It is meant to make people think, how in the world did we do that, and isn't it a marvelous thing that we did? My wife keeps on telling me my worst fault is that I keep things to myself and appear relaxed but I am really in a room in my own head and not hearing the thing anyone is saying. Show up on time. Know your lines. Have an idea of what to do in the scene. The rest will take care of itself. Some people go to bed at night thinking, that was a good day. I am one of those who worries and asks, how did I screw up today? Everybody has something that chews them up. And for me, that thing was always loneliness. The cinema has the power to make you not feel lonely, even when you are. There's millions of survivors out there make it one million and one. The nature of the movies is different than it was five years ago, and they're all driven by the possibilities of CGI, which means you can make anything happen on screen that you can possibly desire. There's a difference between solitude and loneliness. I can understand the concept of being a monk for a while. If you're funny, if there's something that makes you laugh, then every day's going to be okay. If it wasn't hard, everyone would do it. It's the hard that makes it great. Truth is, I'll never know all there is to know about you just as you will never know all there is to know about me. Humans are by nature too complicated to be understood fully. So we can choose either to approach our fellow human beings with suspicion or to approach them with an open mind, a dash of optimism, and a great deal of candor. I went to college because I didn't have anywhere else to go, and it was a fabulous hang. And while I was there, I was exposed to this world that I didn't know was possible. I will entertain anything. It doesn't matter. You know, it's not obviously about the price. It's not about who. It's kind of about when and what. It's material. That's all. <laughs>